Hi there, Lonnie coming to you from the studio. If you tuned in last time, you saw that I was beginning to go a little nuts with paper casting. I have uh, done several rounds of it now and I've developed my recipe and I'm, I'm really liking the, the, the things that we're getting out of our silicone molds. And everybody's been asking like, what are you doing? What are you up to? And quite frankly, I don't really know all of it. I know that I'm feeling really good about making some stuff and then I'm going to continue to visit with you as I develop um, with these materials. We started with a bunch of molds and paper. We've cast a bunch of stuff. Um, and in this video, I just want to show you um, some of the tools I'm using for sort of the probably the un most unglamorous part of, of the process, which is to, after we've cast the uh, pieces, um, they have to be they have to be trimmed up and uh, chased. I'm using several things for that. I'm using some um, 150 grit sandpaper, which works really, really well. Works really well to get the edges down around the uh, on the back because there's often a little bit of a sink uh, with the castings. I'm using these beautiful Joyce Shin scissors. They're kitchen scissors, sometimes called bonsai scissors. I discovered them at confectionery school. Um, they're very tight and you have a lot of control. And then of course I'm using an X-Acto knife and I'm working on a cutting surface so that your blades, you know, go blow through so many blades. Um, so the uh, paper mache pieces have been, uh, are, are being trimmed, um, chased, sanded, and then I'm using uh, gesso to uh, uh, whitewash the pieces, especially the, the gray pieces where I used a lot of junk paper, and get and and put a nice surface on the paper mache. I loaded the gesso with some extra white marble dust um, that I had to give the gesso a little bit more tooth and to keep that really absorbent paper surface. And uh, we have a few hundred parts now to start making things with. When I come back to you next time. I'm going to show you coating and painting and we're going to start getting into some color and leafing and glittering and all the good gooey stuff. So all the sparkly stuff. So anyway, it's nice visiting with you. Thank you very much for all your uh, comments and feedback on, on the video. I'm going to keep on doing this because it's one way to, to visit, as I said, and uh, hope you stay tuned. Thanks.